Nope. It's a little bit of money. A little bit of money to uh, stave off this. <sighs> I mean, strength wise, I think I'm. Manpower wise, I'm fine. But I don't like the fact that I'm constantly losing money because then it forces all this to friggin... Yep, that's someone else who likes me a little bit more. Good. What are we doing with that law? <sighs> more robbers. See, that's now cutting down into my living limit. It's just all fucking spiraling out of control now. There's nothing I can do. Because I'm just losing so much money. Because my goddamn freaking emperor, because he's an abs, because he's a drunkard. Is there a way to freaking get myself out of? I know, I know they used to be. Yeah, Princess of Denmark, why not? Uh, can you just like, die please? He's very nice. Look, 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 look at his son. His son is making money. <laughs> but because you are such an awful friggin' ruler and you were so awful early on, I really want the options to get rid of some of these things. The game is not doing it. And I'm stuck here. Until either he dies or something happens that gives me some money, I am stuck in this position. Because <sighs> that law is not getting passed and I can't do anything to make it pass. Here we're doing faction mines. There's something up to 50, over 50% now. The elective succession, not gonna happen. I should never have let my treasury go negative. How about you never become drunk? How about that? <laughs> oh dear. Incompetent ruler. Yeah, that's what you are. I've never seen such a such a combination of bad traits. I mean, I knew it was possible, but dear God, I mean, look at it: envious, slothful, gluttonous, and a drunkard. A drunkard. Just it's like the coup d'état. a bunch of money again. Okay, military. Let's see what that does. I don't want to do that because the going to bloody it's going to be the thing that stops me from uh... Oh, for God's sake. You're in debt and you... <laughs> Honest to God. So how much is my debt? 
how much am I losing now? Nothing. Right. Okay. So, no, no, 3.69. We're going to keep it on this for now. Oh, you're sickly. You may not survive. That's another bit of uh, good news. Right. We're just going to sit back, not do anything. And basically... Build up some money. Why stewardship? And now we're starting to make a little bit more money. I should have done that from the from the get go, but I, I mean, look at it. I'm five hundred men off my toll. But we're making money now. So, yeah, it was my um, retinue that was causing me to uh, lose so much money. So now we're just going to build a nice, healthy bank, bank so that I can actually increase the size of my retinue to its actual level. It was really expensive. Uh. Ah, flamboyant schema. Go and marry her. Vice versa about the Fallots create the title the Duchy of Gal Galassia. Well done, good for you. Oh, well done, sir. Well done. You have ne you have expanded the borders of Galas of uh, Britannia by yourself, which is actually quite good because I couldn't do myself. Do you know what? Nice little war. Finish us off. Because it's not going to be using any of my men. And you guys, you guys can just uh, go away. Uh, how are you doing? Uh, not particularly brilliant, but there you go. Oh, hello. Kill him. Oh, holding in Santiago is under siege. Oh, it's Vikings. Wow. Okay. And a bit ambitious, maybe? Possibly? Maybe not? There we go, 57%. Yeah. 76%, 100% off a piece. There we go, fantastic. 
Military. Disband. We have 197. It's going to cost a little bit, but I can balance it out. And I'm going to wait until my retinue is maxed out, and then I will stop balancing it. Mm -hmm. 6,200 men. Very soon. We in 20 minutes. And that's a dangerous faction. Elective succession. No, we're not going to have that happen. And it goes away. There we go. And now we're making money. Finally. 73%. No, it goes away again. You know what? I will personally compensate. Because I was still making money even though I'm fully funding the rebuilding of my uh, retinue. Factions. So who is in this that I... Oh! Your diplomacy is terrible. I'm going... Oh, dear me. Dominance is too big. Okay, I'll do this and then my title. My title. Ah, the Duchy of York now has. Oh, okay. Right, so, anyway. Intrigue. Hold the Grand Tournament. I didn't get the click. Oh, it's because it hasn't done it. There we go. Fine. Two children. My daughter. Who is my... Ah, oh, you only have two daughters at the moment. No, wrong button. Wrong button. I am clicking on the wrong button. Completely wrong. Do you know what? It's going to be me. He's 12, so that's fine. Doesn't matter. And... Year is 10, 1163. Our name is slowly getting bigger. We are actually pressing into uh, Spain or Portugal. Which I think we can actually create. Vice Royalty of Galicia, de Jure. Empire of Hispania. Kingdom of Portugal. Ah, that's the Kingdom of Portugal. So we haven't start. We haven't started pro uh, pressing into Portugal. We would have to compete with Navarra. What is the progress? We are now slowly expanding our borders, becoming larger, more powerful. You are all the way over there. Why is? All right, you guys. Can I? Yeah, it is a retinue. Retinue. Uh 
¿verdad? There we go. We'll just let you get up there. So yeah, my own fault for letting that situation continue on though as it was. Time for the Grand Tournament. Time to be wounded. Most unfortunate. Tragically bound. Tragically being wounded. Tragically being wounded. Wounded. Named! Oh dear. That is very bad, most unfortunate. Oh, and my guest has been killed. Died in battle. Died in the top. Most unfortunate. Wounded. Another death. That is most unfortunate. El Govi Godwine of Wiltshire fought his way to third place. Thought what he did. Well done for the family name. Sibbert vs. Bravery won in second place. Well done. And Lef... Neotham Thomas has been crowned the winner of my grand tournament. Truly deserved it. A glorious event. The Knights of Calatravia. The Order of Cata Calatravia is most recent addition to the Soldiers of the Cross, having just been endorsed by an inner decree issued by the Catholic Church. These knights take their name from the castle recovered in the area from the clutches of the Mullahs and the Infidel. And they stand ready to combat heathens and defend the pious in the name of the, any Catholic ruler who is willing to provide their, for their upkeep. May their battles end in victory. Uh, I hope they will be friends. I do not want to lose the gregarious. Perfect. Oh, independence faction. Wondered when he was going to do that. He only has 13% of mine. I don't think anyone else will join because the rest of Vice... Although, you know, he's a Viceroy. Hmm. But I think that is it for this session. Let us have a look at the world and see how it is progressing. Germania is still just completely falling up. Oh my god. So let's see. Defending against... Well, that's one revolt. Two revolt. French Independence... Revolt League for Independence. So that's... Elective Monarchy. Independence. Guy that just hosts... Guy's host claim for the Germania. Liberation of Burgundy. De Jure... Oh, God. That is just tell. I don't think... I think, yeah, we're going to see the end of the Germanian Empire. That is going to be no longer a thing. County of Fusberg. Duchy of Armenia, which is independent. Interesting. Bavaria. The Kingdom of Bavaria is uh, independent. Let's just. Bavarian revolt. There's just revolts going over everywhere. How's the Byzantine Empire doing? Uh, not bad, I suppose. He is Byzantine Hol Holy War for Crimea. So that could end badly. Georgia is no longer independent. There is no such thing as Georgia anymore. Aw. They were doing so well. And now they are no more. How is... Uh, oh! Delhi is no longer a thing. It is now... Whatever that is. Kingdom of Delhi. Oh, it's been renamed! Okay. But, yeah, that is... It's interesting, isn't it? How... how like giant empires are formed um i really do like it when they start like 
you know, when as soon as Germania got as big as it did, it was like, yeah, that thing's going to collapse eventually. There's, you can't hold on to something that big for that long. At least the AI can't. Usually. And I'm not good enough. I'm, I'm never going to be able to get an empire that big. I'd be surprised. I think the biggest I've ever got was um, Britannia, Espania, and I think I had Aqua um, Francia, France and Aquitaine. Uh, so basically just that, which is actually fairly de uh, fairly big. Uh, da -da -da. Say again, that's what I was looking for. But that'll be full for another session. Financially, we are not. We are thankfully stable again. My drunkard ruler is no more. We now have a semi-decent ruler, although he doesn't have uh, his heir is not necessarily going to be good. Base is two, and he's shy. Oh dear. I mean, his wife's, at least his wife's going to be uh, helping out. So, state diplomacy, spouse and champ, counsellors makes it really, really high. So, mine's 41. Yeah, so half the spouse's stats travel over. Siege leader, which is always good. I'm depressed, which is not good. Anyway, I will see you uh, in another session. Until then. Toodles.